Next, we're going to go and do this now on our shoulder. Here. So we started off being on the hand. And then we're moving down to the elbow, which I can't move nearly as fast. And now we're going to go to the shoulder. We call this shrimping because it looks like I'm a shrimp, right? My elbows and knees are connected. I'm slightly on my side, right? So it should look like a shrimp, but essentially I'm doing this, but I'm moving down my elbow. Eventually I'm on my hand. So you're not going to move very fast. I'm a black belt. I've been doing jujitsu since 1997. This is as fast as I can shrimp. That's it, like I'm not moving that fast. It's not that stunningly athletic, but that's just the way it is, right? I always want something in between me and Stefan. Give me my hand, it can also be my foot. Right now, right? It can, it'll just be my hand and I'm gonna use both my feet to be able to go and create space. Here, when I feel confident, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna kick a little bit Get on my elbow, you have to push stuff in away. And then from here, get onto my hand. And then when I feel confident, go to my knee. And you see how this entire time I can keep stepping away with my arm, with my hand. So I can't just get up. We all we get out, we get up out of bed every single day. We all know how to like just get up, but not with a, a, a 200 pound black belt on top of you. All right, so it needs to be done in a very specific manner, right? The most common mistake with this is people try to do this with their feet or their knees too close together. So they'll be here and then they're, oh, oh no, and I'll go back down. And you get smashed back down. So if I'm here with Stefan, he could just be kneeling to understand this. I think that I'm confident enough to be able to go and just get up. So do you see how I'm here, but you see how, oh man, as soon as I try to stand up, I'll just collapse. What do I need to do? I need to have my knees as far apart as possible, and I need to have my feet as far apart as possible. So that way when I'm here, as Stefan is driving into me, do you see how I get on my hand, and then I bring my knees as far apart as possible. See where my knee is? Coincidentally, it's right where my hand was. And then I'm on the ball of my foot, and then, I can stand up, right? Okay. So, being able to stand up from the shrimping position is critical, right? So, if you have a little bit of time before your very first Brazilian Jiu Jitsu class, do a little bit of shrimping, right? Like, you see how shrimping it's just distance management. If, he, if Stefan was trying to pass my guard, for instance, you see how I'm essentially shrimping, right? I am trying to move my hips to maintain distance. If he's trying to come in, I am moving my hip, I'm moving my hip, I'm moving my hip as he's coming in. So that skill is basically distance management. It is no different. Can you stand up with me, please? If we were boxing, it's this. It's us just moving around, right? If we were boxing is the exact same idea if I'm on my hand or if I'm on my elbow or if I'm on my shoulder, right? It is the exact same idea, right? So when you're at home and you want to do a little bit of practicing, start here on your hand, gravitate to your elbow, and then go to your shoulder.